Well, today's a pretty big day. 17.1 just to get to uh, I-40 where Dad's picked me up. But I'm also going to add on to that another 1.2 so I can go do uh, Primera Lookout. Uh, which is supposed to be just magnificent looking out over the uh, northeast area. So that is about 10 and a half miles down the trail. That'll be a good lunch spot this morning. Uh, I was woken up, I guess you'd say, this morning through uh, somebody else's alarm clock, which was a bit unexpected, uh, to say the least. But I can't really say much because, well, I was pretty much awake anyway. I was already up tossing and turning, so that was at 6.30. Maybe a little bit before, but anyway. Looks like it's going to be another beautiful day for me today, so I'm really excited to see what kind of views I get. Longest day of the trek so far. Here we go. Very peaceful and serene in here. No views, but lots of moss. Really cool. tree that's hollowed out right there it's still alive that's just branches and it's budding how amazing crazy you get a side view here
nice little step there built. How about that? Mount Carrera Lookout. Unbelievable. Worth the climb, every step. Uh, top three. Nice lush forest down here. Smells great too. It's spring, fresh flowers. Beautiful. Burns. Officially leaving the Smokies. Thank you very much, Smokies. You were great. I appreciate you. Fantastic time. Moving on. I can actually hear running water. I haven't heard running water since before the Smokies. And that's just weird. You hear the water running and you hear the traffic and you're at first you're like, is that running water? And then you're like, that is running water. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. I haven't seen running water in a long time. Beautiful waterfall right here. I believe that is my zero chariot 
waiting on me right there with the pops. The angel of a lifetime. Woohoo! Cannot wait. I'm getting back on trail after my first zero day. Passing a little pigeon river here. I'm gonna try to make it up to Max Patch tonight. See how it goes. Beautiful day out here. I got lucky again. I missed the thunderstorms in the rain. Well, I'll tell you. Take a day off trail, you get back gone. I mean, gone maybe three tenths of a mile. It's all uphill, but I'm, I'm tired. Feel the weight of this pack for sure. Uh, so, took my zero yesterday. Legs feel pretty good, even though, you know, I'm trying to get it warmed up right now. Sweating pretty well. Rained last night. And uh, it's not too humid, but it's warm today. Seven, mid 70s, I believe it is. Uh, excited to uh, be back on the trail. Um, Smokey's behind me. So, we'll see how it goes. Everything now is new. And uh, I can't wait. We got red blooming from the pink moon. So there will be pictures and videos of such. And I'm pretty excited to see what these new red flowers and blooms bring for me. Uh, smells great out here. Uh, feels It just feels great to be back out here. So mom and dad, love you. Thank you for the zero day. And uh, all the food, oh, I guess I should say, for anybody that's interested, weighed myself this morning after I ate. Um, with everything I ate for the last day and a half, I have only lost six pounds on the trail, which is good. I'm glad to hear it, actually, because uh, I was worried that I'm losing way too fast. So um, I imagine a lot of it's have gained some muscle in my legs for sure. Replace some of that fat, which muscle weighs more than fat. So that's good. It'll be interesting to see what the next 200 bring as far as weight goes. Uh, give me an idea of... Am I eating enough? Am I not eating enough? Those types of things. So, back on the trail. Happy, happy. Got these posts up here along the trail with the white markers, white blazes on them. Like you don't know where you're going, but yeah, thanks Tennessee, I appreciate it. I finally made it up to Snow Peak, and I tell you, a little climb coming out from where mom and dad dropped me off. That was about five miles ago. That's pretty killer uphill all the way. So up here, have a little lunch, and it's gorgeous. Got those folks to take my picture. I'm going right up there. Snow Peak. Pretty amazing, even with this uh, FAA helper router.
I got to see a uh, tree frog today right before I started up this hill. After I left mom and dad, she was just around the corner right at I-40 waiting on a shuttle. Her and Hamburglar and Alana. And uh, so I had seen them in a little while, so that was really cool to catch up a little bit, see how they were doing. Um, unfortunately, with the miles I'm planning on doing a day, I don't think I'm going to be able to, you know, see them much until maybe uh, trail days, if they can get up there in time for trail days. Uh, they were heading to Asheville uh, with one of the, one of the, uh, another lady that they had hooked up with. Uh, her sister lives there, and they were going to her house, so that was pretty cool. So it's good to catch up Tree Frog for sure. I uh, wish her the best. Hope she's doing great. And uh, hopefully I get to see her again soon. patch it was uh 14.6 miles today and by far the most elevation i've done so far on the trail and it was not easy to do 6600 feet of up so this view is by far the most earned i've taken also Hi Tyler, nice to meet you. Thank you for uh, showing us your dragon staff. You're welcome. I appreciate it. That's really cool. Very 